the Chesapeake Pet Retriever. What distinguish Chesapeake from other dogs and other retrievers above all? First of all, they weren't bred for playing. They were bred for real work. That means that they will read a lot of things into your behavior. What is important and what is not. Then they will sort out the important things based on your behavior and focus on those. So you will probably be training your Chesapeake even when you're not aware of doing it. They learn not just by training but also by watching you and watching other dogs working. That means that you have to think twice before training a chassis. Think twice which mood am I in and what am I really rewarding. Or you might end up being both questioned by your dog and rewarding things that you're not really happy with. With most breeds, that's not a problem. But with a Chesapeake, anything you do twice is a memory and that's how it's supposed to be done. So rewarding a slightly oblique sitting, like I just did with the Spaniel in this film, might establish the sitting for Chessie. So tiny details like delivery. Make sure that you train it so that the dog succeeds and not develop habits that you don't want them to have. So, plan ahead, think things through and help your Chesapeake to succeed because their only goal is to make you happy. I'm well aware about that a lot of people don't agree with me on this, that they think that the Chessies are stubborn, ignorant and hard to teach. But my experiences says that most of them probably started to train their dogs long before they were aware of it and that they have avoided behaviour they later on began to dislike. You're probably not aware of that your smile and your laugh is the best reward a puppy can get and that they will remember that for the rest of their life. And you might be rewarding things you don't want to just by smiling and laughing. Yes, training a Chesapeake must be a bit more complicated, but it will definitely make you a better instructor in the end.